Thank you. Not a community matter. As you may have noticed some uh, scooters popping up all around Fresno. Bird scooters is what they're called. They've officially made their debut, but the city says they're not legal. KC 24's Connie Tran joining us live in the newsroom tonight. So Connie, this is a rental system. How does it work? It is Evan. So if you need one of these birds, all you do is you download their app. You go on it and you find one near you. There's GPS on all of the scooters. You enter in your credit card information and that's how the scooter gets activated. After you drive it around, you can leave it wherever you want and the next person will pick it up and use it from there. Flying across Shaw Avenue, Dylan Bogosian uses his bird to get around. I'm on my way home and there were still three, three there, no one touched them, so I just killed some time and just rode around, rode around uh, state. The company dropped dozens of its electric scooters in the city on Thursday as part of its university pop-up tour. Bogosian first heard of the bird in Los Angeles. The company was founded last September. We rode around Santa Monica, Venice, you know, it's a real cheap, cheap rate. It's pretty much an Uber for scooters. But City of Fresno spokesperson Mark Standriff says Bird filed for their business tax license on Tuesday, and it's still under review. So technically, the company is still unlicensed. We're very concerned about some of the, the health and safety issues, about uh, things being deposited on sidewalks, about blocking wheelchair access, uh, and, and more importantly, uh, the fact that it's against state law to have a motorized scooter on a sidewalk. It costs one dollar to start each ride, plus 20 cents per minute after that. Before you hop on one of these scooters, there are some very important rules to follow. According to the company, you must wear a helmet. You have to be over 18. You have to have a driver's license. No double riding, which means two people can't be on at the same time. And you have to ride one of these on the street, not on the sidewalk. Fresno State says motorized scooters are allowed on campus, but only on the roadways. Bogosian suspects it will be a hit with the students. And the birds are available for riders at 7 o'clock in the morning every day until sunset. Then each night the birds are picked up by a staff member for storage, charging, and any necessary repair. In the studio, Connie Tran, KC24, local news that matters. Connie, thanks. And you can get more information on these bird scooters as well as alerts to breaking news and where this story goes from here by downloading our mobile app. And you can always check out our website as well, yourcentralvalley.com.